Well, good afternoon everybody. How y'all doing? Pretty good here and welcome to the channel. A few days ago, about a week ago or so, I put a video up removing the center console armrest in the Tacoma back here uh, because I was going to send it off to a fellow named Kylan Brimhall and I'll put his information up here a little bit later um, to have it reupholstered, recovered and uh, more stuffing add to it, so it added to it, so it'd be a little bit more comfortable. Well, today uh, the package arrived. You guys can see right there. It is here. And we're going to do a little unboxing, and then I'm going to put it back on the center uh, console here. And we're going to see how it is. So I'm going to take you to the back of the truck. We're actually going to use the bed of the Tacoma today, and I'm going to show you what this looks like. Stay tuned. All right, we've got the box here, as you guys can see. I'm going to be careful when I open it. Obviously, I don't want to slice through the, uh, the center console. So we're going to do this uh, rather carefully. That's pretty good. Let's see if we can get this thing open. FedEx does put some pretty uh, strong glue on their boxes. I will give them that. We're almost there. Can't wait to see what this thing looks like. Cross over a little bit. That should uh, enable me to open it. Set this over here. All right, here we go. Let's see what we've got. Nice and wrapped up. Very cool. This is very similar to the way that I sent it, so that is awesome. Go ahead and cut this thing out. Again, want to be careful so I don't uh, slice into it myself. Oh yeah, awesome. Check it out. Here you go. This is the, uh, the center console. It's just the armrest part itself here. And this is the design I picked out. I went with uh, a little bit of a darker carbon fiber, fiber look rather here. And then red stitching to kind of tie it into the truck a little bit. Now Kylan can do many different things other than this. If you want to be a little more flashy uh, or add a little bit more color to it, uh, you can certainly do that. He can do that as well. This is what I chose. Um, let's give it a quick feel while it's uh, while it's sitting out here, and it's like a uh, it's like a gel under there. Oh man, should feel great on the elbow when driving around. Awesome. That's just awesome. Looks like a pretty darn good job to me. You guys can check it out. Everything is nice and tightly fastened on here looks pretty darn good all right so we're gonna uh, we're gonna take this inside the truck now and uh, and get it installed I'll show you how to do that real quick and then I'll uh, see what it feels like we're gonna go for a ride okay we're out here in the truck and uh, I've got uh, all the pieces I need my screws out of my baggie that I had before and just a Phillips head screwdriver so we're gonna get to it First thing to do is to put on the uh, armrest itself, and to do this, you kind of have to push down on this. Uh, piece right here, whatever you want to call that, the um, spring loaded latch, I guess, just like that. Hopefully you guys could see that. And then the screws are going to go back in these four holes, and I've got the screws out already here. So, let's go ahead and get these started. For this, I am going to just use a screwdriver as opposed to using the drill because I don't want to over tighten them, although that might make it a little quicker anyway, at least to get these started down to, you know, where they really start to grab, I guess. But. That's okay. I'm going to do it the old-fashioned way this time. So, got all the screws in. Let's go ahead and see about tightening those down. Oh yeah, this is a breeze. Very, very simple mod. Um, you know, we have, of course, Christmas coming up. For those of you who uh, 
have trucks or know people that have trucks and stuff, this would make a, uh, a great Christmas gift, I would think. Although I'll leave it to you guys to concoct the story as to why the armrest in the truck you're buying it for is missing. But, you know, it's Christmas. Let's tell people it's Christmas. All right, we've got that back on. So now all that's left is the uh, actual tray part here. And it just fits on like so. Uh, there are a couple of... Uh, little like friction snaps if you will under here you guys can see those actually grab onto these points they actually push in uh, like so so we're gonna put those in and uh, hopefully get it the right way I think I have it the right way this is the first time I've done this myself reassembling anyway so bear with me a minute Well, that's pretty simple. Let's uh, go back over here on this side. I can't see what I'm doing on the other side. <laughs> Makes it a little, a little more difficult to do. But they do just snap in there, like so. So let's go ahead and get the screws in. That'll pull it in. I believe I believe I can fly that is it so works just like it did before again just want to make sure I get all the screws in there properly and they do not tighten uh, real tight you would think matter of fact I think I probably stripped that one so you want to be very careful uh, when you put these in uh, don't go past really when they just start to tighten that's probably all you really need uh, and again, I am uh, prone to stripping them myself. But that's it. It is in. So let me get you guys down off of there. Okay, just uh, just getting back from a quick ride uh, to kind of test out the new armrest. And I got to say, wow. Uh, you know, it's the little things, right? I mean, you don't realize how hard the OEM armrest is until you do something like this. This thing is just awesome. Awesome. Uh, I love it. I love the look of it and the comfort. I swear, it makes the truck more fun to drive. I don't know why. I know it sounds crazy, but uh, wow. Anyway, let's, uh, let's have a look. All right, we've got it all installed. Let me show you guys uh, what it looks like. Again, this is my design, what I picked out. Kylan can actually do... Uh, any armrest for the most part but you'd have to contact him directly just to make sure he can do your model if you're interested but uh, and in many different uh, colors and designs so we'll leave that between you guys and Kylan if you're interested but this is what it looks like in my truck give you some different angles of it just awesome and like I said it now has a much more plush feel to it should be much better on the elbow, especially if you uh, spend a lot of seat time in your truck. But uh, I just think it's uh, it's awesome. I love the way it came out. The craftsmanship is spot on, and uh, I would definitely recommend this mod. For anybody who's looking to do something like this, also spruces up the truck a little bit on the inside. Um, I'll leave again Kylan's name uh, spelled out for you guys uh, shortly. Uh, again, he can do pretty much any armrest that's already upholstered or covered, but you have to contact him directly just to make sure. He's uh, most easily reachable on Facebook, and again, it's Kylin, which is K-Y-L-I-N, last name Brimhall, B-R-I-M, as in Mary, H-A-L-L, -L, and we'll spell that out for you right here. And uh, if you're interested, give him, uh, give him a shout. Send him an instant message, contact him on Facebook, and uh, see if he can do something like this for you. A couple people have asked me from the previous video what the turnaround time was. Uh, just a little bit less than a week from when I actually sent it in to when I got it back. 
and I did send it so it arrived on a Friday uh, so you really can't count the weekend I guess so about five days or so something like that uh, it was sent back to me again very happy with it love the way it came out I'll put a couple pictures here at the end of this one and then another picture that Kylan had sent me from another job he had done to see so you guys can see something a little more flashy than what I have I guess anyway appreciate you guys watching please give this video a big thumbs up Let me know what you think of this mod don't forget to click that subscribe button and we'll see you next time on the web have a good day Bye.